Yeah, what flavor was it? Big juicy cock? The Cornado has become standard fare at rock concerts. Some of you may have even given this sign at a concert just because everybody else was. What you probably didn't know is that its roots are in the occult and that it's a universally recognized symbol for Satan, for Satan, for Satan, for Satan, for Satan. Let me 
I bet this is about the only way you can get laid. Is he gonna help you get it up? No, bitch. This ain't my style. on top of my head. It was wonderful. It was just, I was just, I came on the spot without touching myself or anything. It was great. It was just like, he was like, oh, so you like that. content themselves simply with mocking the Lord's name. Fight to the end, kill to the ground. 
fucking dickheads that are like straight edge. Leave the pub now, you fucking assholes. Okay, uh, I have prepared a statement. Uh, as everyone knows, Tony has an extremely large penis. Unfortunately for the girl involved, she was unaware of the fact. Uh, charges against Tony have been dropped as the damage uh, was deemed accidental. Uh, Tony would like to thank the public uh, for their understanding in this matter, uh, and I have no further questions to answer at this time. Thank you. The most familiar satanic symbol is the headband of Vince Neil.
when I still do, still do have uh, the old compulsions.
He expresses all the notes he plays with his face and with his body motions. When you start getting a solo down or a lead down, go in front of a mirror and see the way you look when you play it, because you want to present yourself right to the people also. to Blood Duster FM.
and you know, he'd take a little shit and he'd smear it under my nose and try to, you know, you know, the smell at first I was a little concerned about. And he was like, well, here, let me show you how nice you can smell. It was actually very nice. I was very surprised, you know.